Oh God. I don't know if you can even tell if you can even see the oil. Ugh. So it's a beautiful day in New Jersey and I'm with my buddy Jay, Journey with Jay, and we are completely out of our comfort zone. We are kayaking in this murky river with all of our camera equipment, searching for a huge abandoned boat somewhere down through this maze filled with oil and garbage. Pretty gross here. Oh my God. <laughs> this is disgusting. <laughs> this is so gross. And for those of you who say I should probably pick that up, I would sink my kayak trying to pick up all this stuff. <laughs> we are very committed to uh, finding this abandoned boat. <laughs> Oh man, and that murky, disgusting water. We're not kidding about this water. You can actually see the oil sitting on top. I think it's oil. I mean, I'm not an avid boater, but uh, we are. there's a lot of industrial stuff around here, and I think this is a very polluted area, but... And before I forget, I want to say thank you to all of you who went over and bought a t-shirt. I didn't really post much about it, but I did add a link. There are some of my shirts that you can go and buy. So thank you very much. And if you have not already, go check them out. The link is down below. There's a couple designs and there's certainly more coming. And we've found the boat. Look at that, just past the weeds hidden away in this little offshoot. This thing looks like it's been here for a long time. What do you think, Jay? That's awesome. Bigger than I thought. That's what she said. <laughs> wow. Oh, this water stinks. Look at this, you're seeing in here before I am. Because I cannot see in there. Look at that. But there are some stairs too. I can't wait to get in there. Are those windows right there? The Full disclaimer, I know nothing about boats. I, it's, they float. I don't know anything about like, you know, what these names are called or whatever, so. Don't expect to hear any real phrases of anything throughout this video. All right, we got the kayaks on the bank and from here we walk a short, short distance. Yeah, I'm just gonna try to push these things down as I step on them, because who knows what's below us. Luckily, I don't get poison ivy. Oh, yeah, I remember you saying that at the moment. <laughs> yeah. So we trekked all the way through the woods, finally made it to the ship. This thing is monstrous. Way, way bigger than I thought it was going to be. Uh, appears to be the only way you can get on it is uh, by way of these PVC pipes. I don't. Oh, these are just laying here. It looks like somebody might have just put them here so they can get on it. How's your balance? <laughs> these are just pipes sitting here. And my feet are entwined in these plants and bushes. Yeah, it's no big deal if I fall. I just fall into the, some disgusting, murky water and get diseases. Wow, I 
I made it on here. All right, I'm going to step off of this now. Because right, I good. think he got it. Yeah. All right. Good deal. We're on. Welcome aboard. <laughs> Three levels. This thing looks like a house. I figured I saw holes on the left side. I don't know what the definition of a yacht is, but it looks like it was a yacht to me. Oh wow, that's it's soft. Look at that. Beautiful fold down desk. Light and some very antique phone. say something dry I don't know original socks dirty socks this is the bathroom with, I think on the other side of this is the shower. Complete with cobwebs. Let's see if this door is locked. I hope it's not. Oh, it's not at all. Oh, wow. Look at this. Whew. Looks like it's been totally stripped. Except for just a few things. Yeah, this has been sitting here for years. Looks like this had a Hercules diesel engine, six cylinder diesel. Oh, and I also want to give a shout out to everyone on Patreon. Uh, I hope you're loving all the extra footage videos that I put out. This video will also have a bunch of extra footage that I'll be putting out there, but I really appreciate your support and there's definitely more things coming uh, onto Patreon. So I really appreciate that. If you would like to support me in that way and actually see some uh, some extra footage from these places, the link is down below. That would be amazing. It'd be much appreciated. It's been a while since this thing has sailed the open seas. No, I didn't, I didn't go up to the deck yet. 
if you if you know what kind of boat this is or was leave a comment let me know let us know because we have no idea look at these old doors not much space definitely one person so The Ankyo Entertainment System deck. Yeah, there's speakers all throughout this thing. Yeah, this is cassette. Let's see what this is. If it's DVD, that gives us a little bit more. Uh... Well, there's another one right here in the in the drawer. VCR. All right, so the other one is a VCR. No cassette tape in it. Ankyo. That was nice stuff back in the day. Yeah. yeah. You could see all the, it, it was a double, also there's also a double tape deck on it with it. With the equalizer. It's not every day you come across a huge ship buried, hidden away. This is, who knows if this was just abandoned. I know that sometimes these can be very expensive to get rid of, or if at some point it was just got stuck and it was left. I want to get over here because it actually, there's some things Looks like inside here. Oh, here's the shaft. That's where we were. Yeah, I can't find any dates or any make and model at all. But to me, I mean, I don't know anything about boats, but this looks like it was a really nice boat at some point. Look at this horn. I just want to show how much it really is in the woods. Here's a bird's eye view of what we crossed. These makeshift, this makeshift bridge here, these pipes.
No names, no markings, unfortunately. All right, so the coolest thing that I have found on this boat so far, definitely these double doors, these French doors. Look at this. These beautiful old wood doors. Oh man, it stinks in here. Well, you can see the speakers still. Oh yeah, wow, it's a spiral staircase. That's unbelievable. It's just so, it's totally flooded. So we ain't getting down there. It's upside down, let me see. Uh, surf taco, which is in New Jersey, which is that taco place. I think the biggest problem with this main room is that the ceiling caved in. Had the ceiling not cave in, probably would have been not too, too bad in here. Trying to look for a date here, get an idea of how old this boat is, but I'm just seeing nothing. And the entire downstairs is completely flooded out. I'd love to be able to get into that room back there, but there's no way I'm walking in this murk, this muck. Look at this, the rope is still here. Not on a boat that's been sitting here for years. Oh, this is access to that other area that we couldn't get to. It's too bad there's no ladder. Oh man, it stinks down there though. The other side is flooded, so you can't you can't get oh, over there. Yeah. Rusted, rotted mess. You can climb down the road. It's like gym class. Yeah. So far, no name, nothing. So I think I've seen everything on this boat that is worth seeing. I'm looking for Jay, because we're gonna get out of here soon. I don't know where he is. He was somewhere 
before. Oh, here, Jay. Don't do it, Jay. Oh, but I got to at least one time. Jay. Just once. All right, Jay, one time. I'm the king of the world! <sighs> Thanks for watching this video. <laughs> Hope you like this. Make sure you go over to Jay's channel, check him out, subscribe to him, check his video out. We're getting out of here. See you in the next video. <laughs> so we're almost out of here, but the Explorer is not complete without crawling back over the death bridge. <laughs> oh, you're asking for it. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> Yeah, it was definitely a lot easier. Well, they because they don't move down there, so why don't I here? I'll put my foot here.